Hi, good morning everyone. My name is Jane. Today we'll be talking about addition of numbers. What is addition of numbers? It's a result of combining items. We have different names for addition of numbers. It can be sum, total, increase, plus, summation, reckoning, augmentation, etc. When it comes to actions, we have words like adding, combining, and gathering. So if we have numbers like three digit numbers, there's what we call place value, where we have hundred tens and units for three digit numbers, where the three digit numbers like seven, eight, and six, Starting from the right hand side, six is for the unit, eight is for the tens, and seven is for the hundred. So, for today, lesson, I have some questions already with three options each for you to choose one. I want you to try it out on your own, but in case you cannot do it, let's do it together then. For the first one, we have 372 plus 358 here. And the options we have is A, 850, B, 730, C, 689. What do we do? They are all three digit numbers. So we have our hundred tens, tens and units starting from the right hand side. The first one is two. The second one is seven. The last one is three. You put your plus sign the first one it's five and three you add it up you add it up we have eight plus two is ten you choose the last digit from always from the right hand side you put zero then this one you take it over here one plus seven is eight 8 plus 5 is what? We have 13, which is 1 and 3. You write the last one, which is 3. Take over the 1. 3 plus 1 is 4 plus 3, which is what? 7. So the answer to the question is 730. Let's check our options. Is there 730 there? Which is B. This is the correct answer. So the second one will have 536 plus 48. We still have our 100. We still use our 100 tens and units, which the five first one is 536 plus. We have 48. I told you to always start from your right hand side. So starting from your right hand side, we have eight first and then four. Here there's nothing, we can just add our zero. Then you draw your line. Eight plus six or six plus eight is what? We have 14, which is this way. You choose the one, the last one, you write four. Take one over. One plus three is four. Four plus four is eight. 5 plus 0, you all know is 5. So the answer is 584. Let's check our options. Is it there? A is 584. So this is the correct answer. Then the third one, we still have our 100 tens and units. We have 738 plus 216. So we add up 8 plus 6 is what? We have 14. You write 4, carry 1. 1 plus 3 is 4. Plus 1, we have 5. 7 plus 2 is 9. So the answer is 954. Is it in our options there? A is 1,120. B is 950 and C is 954. This is the correct answer. You can see how easy it is. You just use your 100 tens and units for three digit numbers. If it's four digit numbers, you use thousands, 
then hundred, tens, and unit. If you have four digit numbers, you use thousand, hundred, tens, and unit. Which is a four digit number of five, four, three, two. The unit goes to two, the tens goes to three, the hundreds goes to four, and the thousands goes to five. This is where we are going to stop for today. I believe you learned at least, at least I believe you had, you have something you learned from today's lesson. We'll, we'll come again, I will come again next time for another mass topic, with another mass topic. Thanks for watching till this point. Have a nice day. Bye.